Hello guys and welcome back by Ultimate Simulator. All right, let's let's get the new day going. The right thing or clean. All right, let's see. The right thing. Listen here, you little scheming rascal. I've always known that you folks are up to no good, but this is outrageous. How dare you help that impudent tramp to dare to call herself a lady, poison one of the most prominent and handsome citizens of our town. First, he messes with him, and somehow fools poor Tom into marrying her. And the next thing we know, she kills him in cold blood. I've just started the investigation, but everything is clear as day. You made the potion, and Rosea used it to kill her husband. Soon, I will get all the proof I need to put her behind bars. Your only chance of not sharing the cell with that no-good murderer is if you do the right thing now and start cooperating with the law. And the law? In our fair town is me. So what I need you to do is send me a cure potion, a cure disease potion. I know for a fact that if it is used on a potion treatment body, it will remove the potion, but amid a visible green smoke. This will be all the proof I need. In the meantime, I need to go and set that stupid mortician straight. Can you imagine that old fool has told me? And my deputy that he will only give the body to the doctor no good widow. Just wait till I get to him. Okay. I need to make a cure disease potion. I get a hundred of that. The other is cleaning up. I was warned that messing up with your sort of people is bound to end badly. But I never expected such a tragic outcome. As you probably know, my husband has died yesterday. And the horrible part of that, the poison veil that you have sent me is missing, and the pestering sheriff keep annoying me with his rude questions. I am pretty sure that he thinks that I that it was me who killed my husband. This is unthinkable. How can anyone assume that I would use such an obvious met method of disposing a person? Clearly someone who set me up. This is all your fault. If you hadn't sent me the potions, nothing would have happened. But now I need to deal with this mess and clean it up for you. Thank God local magician is both very fond of games of change and not very lucky. He has told me for a small donation that if I pour some cure disease potion over a poisoned man's body, it will remove all the traces of said potion. Therefore you must send me one of these potions this instant before the shivers get to the body. Miss Rosea. Uh... Right, yes, oh, okay, I think I want to go to Felix, I'm not sure. I want to go with Felix, I don't know, let's, let's, let's go the right path. All right. Oh, I forgot the button. There we go. The right thing, cure disease potion. Okay. So, cure disease potion is two times health. Um, easy, that one. Two times. Wait, did I not? Yeah, I did buy it. Alright, did I already had coal though? I did. So I need to cut off heat. Uh, heat and cold. Cut off heat. So I would have be. I, I would have made a cure disease potions anyway. Um, but she said I want to get rid of the mess that you made, even though the sheriff told me has a green smoke coming over it. So that would mean that I will be fucked anyway. So I think if I went with her, I would be fact even more. I've not opened this one yet. It was another. Yeah, that's another door. I think I don't know. So cure disease potion. I like the storyline. There we go. No. Well, I guess it had to happen at some point. We are not officially ratting out our clients and helping the law, but I guess we didn't have any other choice there. I agree, I don't think we really had another choice there. Alright, the unlucky turn. An unlucky turn. Oh, 
If only I had listened to your friend and left earlier. The potion to reach him might have been enough for me to get home, but I couldn't just leave when the car table was so hot. I just needed to pay one more hint. As a result, I was robbed and beaten senseless right after leaving the casino, and I'm not even even have enough money for the doctor. I only have enough left for a single healing potion. Hopefully, it will be enough to at least ease the pain a little bit. Okay. Uh, let's make healing potion, man. So I need health and light. Um, so heal is probably again cutting off from coal and light. Um, It will be cutting off. Yeah, that will be what I need. So how much of the healing herb do I already have? Does it show me? Let's buy all of them. Five should be enough. Okay. That's a healing herb. So I need to get life of this thing. And then I need to go one up, so I need to mortar it. Then I need coal. I need to cut um heat of it. This should be right, yeah, this is the right one. And then I need to go from that one, one, okay, so I need to mortar this also. Okay, that's that one. Let's make it. Thank you. Poor fellow. If only he had listened to me. <laughs> I agree. I sort of agree. Emperor of the United States, Lord States. Dear grandson, my adventure is near the completion. I've made it through the Pacific and have safely landed to San Francisco. It is a beautiful, very unusual city. It seems that there are more dogs than people here. Also, they have a prison that occupies the whole island. However, the most peculiar thing is that I've met here the Emperor of the United States. His name is Joshua Norton, but he is this that I call him Your Highness. Anyways, regardless of being the weirdest person I've ever met, he is very hospital is a very hospital person and I quite enjoy his company. Unfortunately, Miss Norton has fallen quite sick lately. Please send me a cure disease potion and I hope. It arrives soon. Alright, that's easy. That's just like two coal and I'll buy it to I'll have eight. Just let's take the two that we have here. That one cut heat of it. That's over there. It's another one cut heat of it. I'll put that in there and cook. Take the potion off and deliver it. There we go. An emperor? I thought they had a president over there in the States. It's really weird. I agree. Well, that was all the things that I had for this day. So let's end this day and go up to the next. Skip the day. Yes, the year of the wise rat. Mm-hmm, sure. Alright. 
Let's see what we have to do now. Is the sheriff from the Rosie's probably extremely pissed? Yep. A new start. Thank you for the healing potions you've sent me last time, but fortunately I didn't get the chance to cover my death before I was robbed. The other night, and now I'm facing even bigger danger in the face of my creditors. I have made a decision to follow my childhood dream and become a prospector. There is a place up north where the gold was recently found. Something tells me that a cold resistant potion will be invaluable for me there. So you want to have a cold resistance potion, all right? So we know that one is cool. And now we need two of the heat. Maybe I could do with that one. Um, no, I, I think I need to do it with the coal. Let's just get three coal. Because honestly, if I get that off... Oh! Wait, did I need to? Yeah, I need to dry coal. So I need to cut heat from coal. And then I need to cut life from coal and then dry it. I so love the way this looks. Jesus. Life. There we go. No! I made a mistake. Probably nothing. Yes, exactly. I thought so. I still needed to dry this shit. I just yeeted it in there with the fire. Though we need heat. So you need to be dried. That's what we needed. Now we're heating in heat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. There we go. Let's buy some more coal just because I fixed it up. Healing herbs. I have enough healing herbs, and I have enough vines. So I'm not going to use that. There we go. This should make the right thing. There we go. Thank you. There you go. The doctor's left the town. I hope you will have more luck in a new place. He has left us his lucky rabbit foot charm, but apparently it doesn't work. Where's the lucky bear? Lucky rabbit foot charm. Should be a. Oh, there it is. Alright, next. This one. The first is help to find the killer. Glad to inform you that your folk are not as useless as I've initial, initially thought. Thanks to my wit and professionalism, and a little bit to your potion, we now have proof that Thomas was killed. Unfortunately, a judge is not as insightful as I am, and he claims that there is still not enough proof that Thomas was killed by that wicked woman. Send me your deception potion. You should help me convince that old fool. The other has killed a curious person. This has most definitely gone too far, my friend. This pestering sheriff have left us no other choice except for getting rid of him. I have heard a rumour that his heart is not the best condition. A little nudge will help him of a burden potion could push him over the edge. And his nightmare will be over. No. That's way more pay. I will go over this one, a deception potion. I'm now helping the law, so I will help the law. I'm 
commit it. All right, so we need ice. I think that was from a cocoon. Yeah, you can take the cocoon and then get the heat off. The other two, though. Um, I just need one bug. I think we need one bug. Yeah, this one becomes that one, and that one becomes that one, and then we have what we need. Oh, we don't. Wait, I'm confused. What was the bug again? No, I'm confused. Where's my bug? That's a bug. I need to cut that off, and that is... Order and chaos. I think I need to cut order off. Uh, I don't need to cut anything off. I need to cut order off and then I need to dry it. Yeah, because drying is going that way and I need those too, so I need to dry it. Uh, the other one is a cocoon, and the cocoon needs to be cut heat off. Oh, yeah. Um, right, just... No, if I just dry it, it should not be enough. Um... Negative. Night and day. I need to have the other one, I think. I think this will work. Yes. And then we dry that one. Oh, if I would have just dried it, they would have got rid of the other thing anyway. That was quite useless, though. Got the eyes already getting dark, Jesus. Oh, we will fix this one, though. Pick up deception potion, that's what we needed. There we go. It looks like the sheriff has finally managed to close this case. I wonder what will happen in court. Anyways, I'm glad that this whole story is over and we even got some sort of a medal. Whatever that thing is. Oh, there. The third best depth of the month. Murder play given to the title. Third best depth of the month. Jesus Christ. Alright, well, with that I will end this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked it. And I hope I'll see you guys in the next one to make. Bye-bye.